Here's how to play Susano in Smite 2. Susano is a strength-based melee character who is best played in the jungle. He's also one of my favorite characters in Smite 2 right now. Susano's passive is Storm Edge. Basically what it does is after you use an ability, you get an enhanced auto attack. And this is really important to have Susano reach his max potential. The first ability you want to unlock with him is his first ability, Storm Kata. Upon using it the first time, Susano does damage in a cone in front of him, and then using it a second time, he does damage in a circle around him, and then finally, the third use of it has Susano dashing through enemy gods and minions, dealing damage at all three of these uses. Now, this is super important if you want to maximize this ability's potential. You want to make sure you're auto-attacking between every use of this ability, because if you're not, you'll sorely be lacking the damage needed. Susano's second ability is Wind Cipher. Susano does damage in a cone in front of him in three sectors. If you hit enemy gods in the center sector, it will pull enemies towards you. Susano's third ability is Jetstream. Susano throws out a gust of wind in front of him, dealing damage and stopping on the first minion or enemy god hit. This ability does tick damage and lingers for a few, but more importantly, if you reactivate this ability, you can teleport to where this ability had landed. If you hit an enemy god with it, you will teleport to wherever that enemy god is. Susano's ultimate is Typhoon. When used his ability, Susano summons a Typhoon at his location, increases in size and strength before firing in the direction you're looking at. Once the Typhoon reaches full size, it will also knock up enemy gods. You can reactivate this ability at any time to fire it prematurely for less damage. I said this already, but I cannot stress it enough. The most important thing about Susano is auto attack canceling, or in other words, getting your auto attacks in between each ability. A common practice I like to do with Susano's ability orders is use my third ability, Jet Stream, auto attack, use my second ability, Wind Cipher, auto attack, use the first use of Storm Kata, auto attack, use it again, auto attack, use it again, auto attack. Now obviously this is an ideal scenario, and most likely if the god you're fighting has an escape, they're going to use it, and this is when your third ability becomes really useful, because if they dash away or escape or blink or anything like that, you can reactivate your third ability to teleport directly to them. The build I like to go on Susano is Boomba's Cudgel, Transcendence, Hydra's Lament, Pendulum Blade, Heartseeker, Titan's Bane, Teiko Kagai, and Blink Rune. Susano has great mobility and good crowd control on top of just high damage scaling, which makes him a really fun jungler to play right now. So I hope you give him a try, and if you need to, 